The distributive property is where you have something on the outside of parentheses and it pays a visit to the things on the inside. Now it's called the distributive property because technically the thing on the outside is being distributed to the things on the inside of the parentheses, but you know what? I like saying visits better than distributes. Helps me understand it better and maybe you'll feel the same way. Let me give you an example and show you how it works. Let's say on the outside of the parentheses we have two and on the inside four plus three. All right, let's use the distributive property. Let's have that two pay a visit to the four and a visit to the three. And we use multiplication. So we do two times four, two times three, then add them together. Two times four is eight, two times three is six, Eight plus six is 14. That's how we use the distributive property. Let me give you one more example. Now, they don't always have to be just numbers in there. I'll show you what I mean. On the outside of the parentheses, let's have a three. And on the inside, let's have x plus two. All right, let's do this. Let's have the three pay a visit to the x and a visit to the two using multiplication. Three times x and then three times two and we'll add them together. So three times x is three x. 3 times 2 is 6, and so our final answer is 3x plus 6. That's how we use the visiting, the distributive property.